Bart's word law can be used to find the magnetic field due to long straight wire. We know from Bart's word law that D B equals to mu naught by 4 pi I D L cross R R cap by R square or cap R vector by R cube. So in our problem we have to measure the magnetic field due to this straight current uh, element of carrying current I uh, at the point P uh, from the where with the distance X. So let X is the perpendicular distance and the let this is the current element DL and this distance is R. So if the angle between the current element and the R is theta then L cross R gives mu naught by 4 pi I DL R unit mean 1 sin phi by R square. Let this angle is theta. So if we draw, draw, draw a parallel then this also a this angle should be theta so phi should be so phi equals to 90 plus theta because this is 90 and this is at theta so sin phi equals to sin 90 plus theta that is cos theta so the, our equation convert to db equals to mu naught by 4 pi IDL cos theta by R square again DL is varying let the uh, the distance between this DL and the origin equals to L then L by X if L by X equals to tan theta so L equals to X tan theta so DL equals to DL equals to X X square theta D theta so in our equation there another variable another variable equals to R square DL convert in terms of theta and we have to convert R in terms of theta so uh, from the figure x by r equals to cos theta again x by r equals to cos theta that is 1 by r square equals to cos square theta by x square so putting this value of uh, 1 by r square dl in this equation we get db equals to db equals to mu naught by 4 pi i ax x square theta d theta into cos square theta by x square so x square theta cos square theta cancel out So our equation convert to there will be another cos theta ideal into cos theta. So cos square theta six square theta cancel is out. So this gives mu naught by four pi x cos theta d theta. So b equals to b equals to integration of this that is mu naught by four pi x integration of cos theta d theta if the limit let this is a finite so let, let this gives theta 2 
so let the there will be two angle theta one and theta two let this is theta one and uh, find this angle gives theta two so our limit should be theta one to theta two and finally after integration we get mu naught by four pi x sin theta two minus sin theta one so these are solution and and direction should be so this is the current element so imagine a screw is going to this direction like using the core screw rule a screw is going to this direction so we have to rotate this along this direction so obviously the current is yes, magnetic field is along this direction that is perpendicular to the dl and r that is inward to the two bore so this is the direction and the magnitude mu naught by 4 pi x sin theta 2 minus sin theta 1 uh, if we take finite wire if i take finite wire then theta 1 theta 2 goes to pi by 2 and minus pi by 2 if wire is infinite then theta 1 equals to minus pi by 2 and theta 2 equals to pi by 2 then b equals to mu naught by 4 pi x sin pi by 2 means 1 there will be minus or minus sin pi by 2 plus 1 that is 2 so mu naught by mu naught sorry there is a mu naught i i am missing mu naught i so there is mu naught i by 2 pi x